Live from San Francisco, it's The Q. Here's your host, Jeff Frick. Hi, Jeff Frick here with The Q. We are on the ground at Pier 48 in San Francisco at the Top Coder Open 14, an event. Uh, well, actually, we'll get the history of the event. Uh, for right here, I'm joined by Narendra Singh, co-founder and uh, chief strategy officer of Piero, the, uh, the founding sponsor of this event. Welcome. Thank you so much for having me. We're ha thank you for coming out. Yeah, so uh, give us a little background on, on TCO. What, what's kind of the history? So the Top Coder Open, each year we bring the hundred of the best designers, developers, and data scientists in one place. They've competed all year to qualify to be here. And then they compete in live competitions at the event, in algorithm competitions, in first to finish coding competitions, and design competitions on site to see who the best of the best is for the year. And what, what is the kind of the theme of the coding? What types of uh, applications are they building? So they'll be build anything from algorithms that power you know, really complex problems and they'll solve them very quickly. We have one that's kind of a quick hit. They have three problems to solve in 75 minutes against the clock, against each other. And then we have what's called the marathon algorithm competition, 12 straight hours of them coding and trying to deal with a really, really difficult problem. This year it was a simulation of putting out a forest fire over a diverse set of land and area. And so those are some of the problems on the algorithm side. We also have designers who from scratch will create a complete design paradigm this year. It was for 3D systems and how they could create a mobile application experience. So diverse sets of technology challenges that really highlights various parts of the discipline. And how many years have you been doing this? This is the 14th Top Coder Open. We started off um, many, many years ago with a small event, and this is the biggest event we've ever had. And about how many people? So we'll have over 1,000 people in and out, and we've got great sponsors, kind of the who's who's of Silicon Valley, Facebook, Google, Amazon, Salesforce, many, many companies that represent a lot of the best technologists and a lot of the places that alumni from the Top Coder community have ended up. So it's kind of a reunion of sorts. All right, awesome. But why we are here is it's, it's Women in Tech Wednesday, as everybody knows it follows the Cube, and we heard about um, your STEM panel and Girls in STEM, something that we're passionate about. And so we heard about the panel, want to come up and cover it. So give us a little bit about the, the Girls in STEM, how that fits in with the show. Now, one of the big things is this year we wanted to reconnect the top Top Coder competition with the technology industry overall. And so we're also very passionate about girls in STEM. We had a number of events here this week that focused on women in technology. And also we had events around hackathons and pickup games and competitions. Today what we did is we brought five great women and a male advocate to talk to almost 200 high school young women about careers in technology. Because it's not just about programmers. And one of my favorite things was one of the women said, I love to code and dance. And that's OK. Right? Really trying to break some of the stereotypes that are out there and help young women see all the different possibilities of technology paths that they can undertake. Yeah, you had great representation. You had high schools from the Peninsula, San Jose, San Francisco, the East Bay, even out, I think, Livermore, out, uh, out, out over on the other side in the hot area. So we're excited. We're going to talk to all the panelists. We're going to get them all on. I, I was also struck by a lot of talk of dance, a lot of talk of human factors, uh, puzzle puzzle solving, you know, the kind of the, the things that underlie going into this into this type of uh, industry. Now, it was a great panel because it really covered a lot of topics. Um, I actually particularly enjoyed coding and dance because that was a panel I could relate to and it was the first time I'd seen that at a technology panel. So it wasn't just for young women. Great. So Narendra, thanks uh, for inviting us up. Uh, great for you for, for sponsoring Girls in STEM. You know, they can't get enough support, can't get enough attention, and, uh, and thanks for inviting us up. Well, thanks for coming and we hope this is just the start. All right, Jeff Frick here on the ground, Pier 48 at the Top Coder Open 2014.